first pitch to Joey. Curve ball goes with it right side, fairly deep. That should chase the runner home. Hewen underneath it. Throw goes to second base, an RBI sacrifice fly for Joey Metropolis. And the Miners have a 1-0 lead here in the first inning. Not a lot of empty seats. Pitch out, throw down to second. And Tony Roth puts, misses the tag, but the oversliding of the bag, and Colton is out. Well, the Miners guessed right, called for the pitch out. Gersenzi one-hopped it in there. Two offerings. Zafiro gives him a slider, swung on and missed. Strike three. That was a two to one in game one of their doubleheader. Game two not underway yet. This one grounded a slow roller left side. Camp up with it over to first on the money. Two down. First pitch to Hewen. Ground ball up the middle, base hit. Let's see if Billick tries to score. Millens comes up firing the throw to the plate in time on the money. Gunned him down, and the inning comes to an end as Jeremy Millens hoses Joe Billick at home plate. Bottom of the third coming up. Miners still up. 1-0 on the Miners radio network. First pitch to Holdren. Runner stays put. This one lined into right field. Base hit for Holdren, and the Miners have a 2-0 lead. Millen stays put at second base as the throw gets past the second baseman and into third. I don't know. What did, uh, what did Mike Pinto tell the guys? Hey, don't let don't let Flake get, get behind or get ahead in the count. And just now the one, two. Runner breaks for third. Throw gets away from the catcher, Billick. Stolen base number 21 on the season for Jeremy Millens. Oh, Dang. yeah. Not traveling with the trainer? No. Runner breaks for second and... Again, they and get And again, him. he overslides the base. Not he personally, but Hewen overslides the base, is thrown out. So that it is uh, it's actually a stolen base, but the overslide, he's tagged out. One, two, cut on and missed strike three. That is a huge strikeout for Revelette. Good at bat by Maddox, but good good job by Revelette not, not losing the game series. 3-2 is high for ball four. The go-ahead run reaches base with nobody out here in the seventh. And the on Miners down 4-3, bottom of the seventh with one out. Sawyer sets up outside again. This one left over the plate, check swing. Ground ball back to the pitcher over to second for one, and they turn it. What an anticlimactic ending as Adam Hale couldn't check his swing, and the River City Rascals hold on for a four to three win over the Miners, sweeping the double header and dropping the Southern Illinois Miners to 33 and 29 on the season. We'll take a break and wrap things up in just a moment right here on the Miners Radio Network. Just how big of a Southern Illinois Miners fan are you? Hi, this is Bill Bond in the Seconds with People's National Bank. Show your love for the Miners today by opening a Southern Illinois Miners checking account. It only takes $100 to open, and every time the Miners win, you win too. That's right, every time the Miners win a regular season or postseason game, your interest rate goes up. Stop by your local People's National Bank today to find out more. 